I'm Jonathan Lewis. I'm a pilot with JARS, and I'll be serving in Sintani, Indonesia with Yajasi. In terms of linguistics, Papua New Guinea and uh, Indonesia are the largest centers for languages that still need Bible translation. And it's also one of the most challenging places to fly in the world. It's really cool to, to be up here and see all the mountains and to actually be able to do all the things that we practice. And we've kind of looked at all the individual components, like how do you fly solo aircrafts like the Helio, and then how do you land on short wind rays, how do you land in grass. And then here, we're kind of putting that all together in, in like a capstone project, essentially. Where we're combining all that along with the added challenges of doing ridge crossings and the lift and sink that comes as the wind flows over the mountains. The mountain flying and the, the weather that changes fast and the low visibility and decisions that you have to make to keep lots of options open. In this particular mountain week, we've had to apply a lot of that, not just simulate it, which makes it actually in some ways easier to teach. It's very narrow. I mean, the airstrip is about as wide as the wings are. The terrain kind of goes up and down, and every time it goes up, you know, the winds go up with it, and then they go down as it goes back down. So you're constantly having to put corrections, essentially, to make sure you're on a stable flight path to the runway. There's another runway called Strawberry Ridge that is um, just a little bit to the west of us. And that one is right near the top of kind of a knoll. So we have a short touchdown zone where we land and then it goes up to a steeply sloped section. There's not a lot of visual cues and it also has challenging winds. So when you're up on a hill, you get unusual winds that come from different directions. And then the other one we have is called Brown. What makes that one challenging is it's actually at the base of a valley, so you're limited as to how you can set up for the runway because you're maneuvering around terrain. In the mountains around here is very similar to flying in the mountains in Indonesia, so this is a great place to train, especially.